Hey what's going on guys my name's Raph and with Ash winning the Alola League it's time for him to take on his Alolan father figure Professor Kukui aka the Master Royale. The battle has already begun from episode 141 of the Pokemon Sun and Moon anime and so far it's looking really intense. We know that Ash is a full team of 6 Pokemon However, Professor Kukui has only revealed 5. The battle between Ash and Kukui has been confirmed to be a 6 on 6 battle, but what is Kukui's Sith Pokemon? Let's jump straight into this speculation and discussion. Please note that this is my opinion, and I totally understand some of you may disagree. But don't hesitate to drop a comment down below telling me what Pokemon you think Kukui has, and I'll be happy to see all of them. Let's jump straight into it. Don't forget to leave this video a like to show your support, and I'll be sure to bring out my next video shortly. Make sure to subscribe if you aren't ready to keep up to date, and without further ado, let's begin. So let's begin by taking a closer look at what Pokemon Kukui has on his team, thanks to Korokoro Koro and the current Pokemon episodes. He has a Venusaur, Empoleon, Lucario, Brivieri, and his Ace Bean Incineroar. Now comparing this to his in-game teams, we notice a large difference between the two, with his anime team having a wider coverage. Of course, many would suspect his Sith Pokemon to be the potential Lycanroc, and it may be a possibility. However, of course we know that the Rockcroft that was under his care was given to Ash, and of course evolved into the fantastic Dust Lycanroc. So now that we've taken a closer look at Kukui's team, let's explore what the potential Sith team member could be. Before I begin, some of the details mentioned are in no particular order, this is just pure speculation. Looking back at Kukui's team, Myself and a few friends have discussed the possibilities of what Pokemon could fill up the Sith spot. The first contender is Pikachu. Now of course the chances of this are very slim, but we thought Pikachu would be a little surprise to the fans. Maybe back as a child, along Kukui's journey, he encountered his very own electric mouse and travelled the region alongside him. Again, this is just an odd one to add into the mixer. The next contender is Tapu Koko. Now seeing as Tapu Koko has fought Ash and Pikachu before in the past, this would be the ultimate way to end off that plot. We've seen Kukui use the Electrum Z before, so maybe he's saving it again just for this occasion. Of course, with Tapu Koko being a legendary Pokemon, maybe Tapu Koko came to an agreement with Kukui to join his side for this battle against Ash, and then of course be released afterwards. Tapu Koko was shown to be watching the battle between Ash and Kukui earlier, and there is also this frame showing Ash with the Electrium Z, which will most likely change into the Bacanium Z, allowing Pikachu to use 10 million volt Thunderbolt against Tapu Koko. And the final contender is a Gala Pokemon. With Kukui clearly travelling across the Pokemon regions obtaining a very diverse Pokemon team, it begins to question now if he has already travelled to Gala ahead of time. It could be a Gala Pokemon, a Galarian form, or maybe a Pokemon that we've just never seen before. My friends believe it could either be the potential Obstagoon, Duraludon, Surfetch, or another Galarian form that would fill this spot. These Pokemon would be the best options as they are relatively new coinciding with the new information we've received about Pokemon Sword and Shield. So now that we've explored the possibilities, there are also a few other options. Firstly, Kukui may just have a standard Alolan Pokemon. It could be one of the Pokemon that he has on his in-game team, but still, that would be a more logical guess. However, saying that, we may never see his final Pokemon at all. This could be due to Kukui defeating Ash before he even gets the chance of finding out what it is. Literally like Tobias all over again. One final detail to point out is how the commentator stated that Kukui's Incineroar is his strongest Pokemon and ace. But still, that doesn't mean he doesn't have something else under his sleeve, this being his Sith team member. So at the time of recording this video, three new episode titles have been revealed, and it has indicated that Tapu Koko will actually be joining Kukui's team. This is very interesting, and I'm also looking forward to seeing how the Pokemon actually joins Kukui's team, alongside Battle Ash for the final time. However, it still makes you think if this is the actual slot being filled up, or the actual Pokemon that is Kukui's Sith spot is being replaced entirely. So what Pokemon do you think is Kukui's Sith team member? Why not let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. If you guys would like to interact with me, then be sure to follow me on Twitter, and join the Team PokerF Discord server to discuss all things Pokemon. You can find the rest of my social networks on screen and in the description below. If you enjoyed the video, then be sure to leave it a like, as your support is greatly appreciated. Don't forget to share the video with your friends. Finally, make sure to subscribe to keep up to date with my videos, and click on the little bell to enable notifications so you guys get notified when I upload a new video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and be sure to stick around for more Pokemon content. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.